Hello, we're going to look at a problem that many people have with the reviewing capabilities of Word. This is a very short video because it's a very quick and easy fix, but lots of people struggle with it. And this is the problem they have. When they're in the reviewing toolbar, they can click on track changes so that any changes they make, I'm going to make this bigger on the keyboard, will come up as things on the right hand side or you, you can you can decide where you want them so I've got them in balloons on the right rather than in line I can make changes I can send that to a proofreader or an editor they can make changes and it'll come up with their name and then I can decide whether I want to accept them so I can accept some and reject others that's fine so when we're working on our manuscripts, we can have them going back and forth with different people. We can look at our own changes. Really, really useful. The problem comes when we finish with those changes and we want to stop showing them. So if we turn off track changes and we tell it that we only want to see the final copy, they don't appear. But if we then close it and reopen it, they do appear. So I'm closing and saving and I'm going to open again. And they're back. We can change it simply to, to show the final appearance. But what if we wanted to send that to somebody else? If we wanted to send a Word document to somebody else and they opened it on their computer, it would do what it just did to me. It would open in that showing markup thing. So how do we change that? And lots of people really struggle with this. And this is how. We're going to go to the Office button up here, then Word Options. And then we're going to go to the Trust Center and click on Trust Center Settings. Try saying that fast. Now, this is the magic line. The checkbox here has told Word that when we open or save, hidden markups, balloons or inline notes are going to be visible. And that means that even if you change it to view the final manuscript, not the one with the markup, when you send it to somebody else and they open it, those markups will be visible unless we deselect it and click OK twice, close it again and open. And it doesn't do that anymore, which is great. I hope you found that useful and that you won't struggle anymore with unwanted markups in your manuscripts. Thanks for watching.